What's going on guys, it is Michael and today I'm back with a really quick meal example that you guys can make in 15 to 20 minutes, really no time at all. We're gonna use some foil in the grill to make some great tasting fish. You can do this with pretty much any type of fish. So let's go ahead and get started. Okay, so right here on the left, I have some ahi tuna. We're gonna cook up this and also some blackened salmon. And with these, they are individually packaged and frozen. So I thawed them out in some hot water before this video. This is the salmon, it's pre-seasoned and just more convenient. And then the ahi tuna down here is not seasoned. And keep in mind, I buy these things frozen because I live in the middle of the United States. I'm from Missouri, if you didn't know. And it is really expensive to buy fresh fish because they have to transport it here. But you can use fresh fish if you want. I just like this. It's convenient. I can keep these in the freezer and don't have to worry about them going bad anytime soon. So the next step to do is just cut open these packets and obviously if you use fresh fish you don't have to worry about that. Then what we're going to do is just take some aluminum foil and I'm going to cook the salmon in one packet of aluminum foil and then the tuna in another. So we'll just set that on the aluminum foil and then from here all that we really have to do is wrap it up like this. So exact same thing for the tuna steaks. And I'm going to use a little bit of Fiesta Lime Mustache, sprinkle that on there. And then some Cajun seasoning. Really easy, it's totally up to you and whatever you want to put on these. Fold the edges so the heat will stay inside of the aluminum foil packet and cook the fish. Okay, so I've already got the grill preheated and ready to go. So all we really have to do with this is just open it up, take each foil packet and set that on the grill. And that's all that you have to do with this. Super easy. You don't even have to sit out here and flip them because they cook in the foil packet. So we will give these, let's say, 10 to 12 minutes and you can check on them. And with fish, it's really just personal preference. How well do you like it cooked? There's some people that eat fish raw, but hey, that's not for me. But I'll see you guys in just a little bit. And while that fish is outside cooking, we've got a couple minutes to kill, so why not just cook up a side item? And this is really easy, some boil and bag instant brown rice. It's ready in 10 minutes. I've got one of the bags in there, which will come out to two cups of cooked rice. And I filled that up with some water. And it's really easy, just turn on the pan, let it boil for 10 minutes, and you have some rice cooked up. And hey, while the rice is cooking, and the fish is outside cooking, why not just prepare a vegetable item and today I'm going to make some spinach and I'm going to show you guys how to steam it in the microwave. If you don't want to use a microwave that's totally up to you. I like to use it. It's quick and convenient but really easy. All you have to do is take a microwave safe bowl similar to this one and then we'll just take the amount of spinach that you want and it will really cook down when it steams. So you can fill the bowl up all the way and then we'll take this over to the sink Give it a little bit of water in the bottom, set that bowl in the microwave, and then it will help cook if you take one of these lids right here and just put it on top of the bowl. We'll kind of trap the steam inside of there. Cook it just a little bit quicker, and I normally start for around 90 seconds. So we'll start that, and then you can always take it out and check on it, and just make sure it is cooking up nicely. And here we are just a little bit later, probably 10 minutes or so. I went and cooked up the rice and the spinach and the fish should be done. So to do it, all you really have to do is take one of these foil packets, open it up and just kind of look and make sure the fish is cooked however you would like. And we'll open this up. And I don't know how well you guys can see this, but the salmon is done, perfectly cooked, and I'm assuming the tuna is done as well. And there you go, right there on that plate, we have our tuna and our salmon cooked up. So let's take this inside and make it a meal. Okay, and how about this right here for a meal that takes 15 to 20 minutes to prepare? Right there, we've got our salmon, our steamed spinach, and then around one cup of brown rice. And before you sit down and enjoy this, you have to put it on Instagram or else you didn't even really eat it, you know? That looks good right about there. Boom. Look at this. 
Instagram Inception. And now that this is on Instagram, it's safe to eat the actual meal. And if you guys want to follow me on Instagram, there is my name right there. What I do is I post pictures of the recipes before I actually upload the video. So if you want to stay updated, that's the place to do it. But I'm going to go eat this now. And that's it for this video. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please leave a like down below. I would appreciate that or a comment letting me know if there's anything else you want to see. And I will try my best to make it. But I hope you have a great weekend and I will talk to you later.